Mish tuning and uh, tuning, toning this kawaii, voicing it, and uh, it was sold inexpensively. I'm not going to say by whom, um, but uh, GS60. Thank you. It's like a mellow sound now, but... but we mellowed it out and evened out the tone. Left the bass still with a bit of zing. sold and uh, it's uh, been sold for 10,000 which is a good price for this type of piano but there's some strange things here that for instance this hammer has been replaced and see that's the red in the felt that's blue in the felt or nothing that's an inferior quality hammer also it's been reshaped and it's been sure reshaped quite a bit but it has it's been reshaped a bit roughly because that, that's very rough also the toning of the hammer has been done, I don't know if you can see that there, or if we can find one, but the toning of the hammer has been done right in the middle of the hammer in some places. Let's find one. There's there. Toning the hammer is done in the middle of the hammer. You don't do that because you can damage the hammer. Uh, the other thing is we found a piece of hammer <laughs> inside the piano on the back there, and then the, we've, I've glued it together. So. That's something else that you don't sell a piano with a hammer missing. Also, the regulation is, is way off. It's, it's just, okay, I can fix that. But it was also the hammers were also stiff. Uh, apart from that, um, I'm not sure what else needs doing until we get going, really. <laughs> 